Okay guys, so this is going to be a primer video. So we got the primers all right here and we're going to be going through them and figuring out what we're going to keep and what we're going to let go of. Okay, so I'm going to do a talk through for this one. There is 73 total primers uh, in this video. So we will see how many we keep and how many we get rid of. This is the first one, the Makeup Forever Step 1. I actually really like the Makeup Forever Step 1 line. I know that there's some older ones, but this one's actually a newer one, so I'm gonna keep it. This is called Embryo Lease, I believe is how you say it. It's basically a moisturizer and primer in one. Um, it's definitely seen better days, so I'm gonna go ahead and declutter this one. Okay, next we have an LC foundation. I actually purchased this myself, but looking at it, um, I think I've had it a while and it definitely needs to go. Okay, this one is the Laura Mercier Foundation Primer. Honestly, I don't love or hate this one, but because I don't love it, I'm gonna go ahead and declutter it. Okay, next we have the Urban Decay D Slick. I do love this or loved it, but it definitely looks like it's went bad in the last little bit, so it's gonna go. Okay, next up we have the Milk Makeup Blur Primer. I actually have, I think, two or three of these. This is a really good primer. It blurs the skin and it's a stick primer and I really like it, so I'm gonna keep it. I'm also gonna keep it sister. And then this last one, I've had it for a while and as you can see, it was very well loved. So that one's gonna go in the trash. This is the Touch and Soul No Problem. <laughs> like problem, but poor blum. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I actually just got this recently. I think maybe in like an Ipsy or a Boxy charm. I'm not sure, but since I just got it, I did use it over the past two weeks when I went to the beach, so I'm gonna keep this to keep using it. Okay, next we have a Prep and Prime from MAC Cosmetics, the Natural Radiance one. I do really like this, but it's been in my collection for a little bit, so it's going to get decluttered. Okay, next we have the Huda Beauty Complexion Perfection. I love Huda's primers, and I love this one, so it's going to be kept. Okay, this is going to be another Milk Makeup one. This is the Milk Hydro. This is a grip primer, and I actually really like this. As you can see, I've used quite a bit, so I'm going to be keeping this. And you guys, before I keep decluttering, I just wanna say really quick, my concerns with my skin are going to be pores, fine lines, wrinkles. Um, I get a little bit oily, so I do like something that's a little bit matte, but then I also like stuff that's like dewy because I want like a really pretty finish, but I don't have like any acne um, for the most part anyway. So that's just kind of a little bit about my skin and that's why these are the choices I'm making. Okay, this next one is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer. Oh my goodness, I literally love this. It is so good, it makes your skin feel so hydrated so it, there's no way that I could get rid of this. Apparently this must be the old formula of that Touch and Soul because it's the same exact name. I'm not sure if these are still good because they look like I don't know if it's where I'd use them for a little bit or if they had just been in my collection for a little bit, but these are going to go. I don't want this video to be super long, so if I see things that can go in groups, that's what we're gonna do. So this is the Hydrating Makeup Forever, which I already kept one of, so I'm gonna put this in my friends and family pile. Then we have the Mattifying Primer, which again, that is one that I absolutely love, so we'll keep that one. And then the Smoothing Primer, even though I love it, uh, I think that it is <laughs> time to go for this one. So, friends and family, keeping, decluttering. Next we have this Marc Jacobs Coconut Primer. Uh, mm, I got a lot of use out of this one, so it's going to be saying goodbye. All right, next we have the Tatcha, the Silk Canvas. This one I'm definitely going to be keeping. Let me kind of show you guys what it looks like. I mean, it's pretty soon going to be ready to be in the empties, but I'm keeping it until I finish it. Okay, next we have the Too Faced Hangover RX Primer. 
This one is like almost done, so I'm gonna go ahead and declutter it. And then this one's brand new, so I will be keeping it. Okay, this is the Maybelline Prime Master. This is the hydrating base. Um, I think I'm actually going to declutter that since I already kept a Makeup Forever hydrating one, so I'll throw this in the declutter pile. This is a ColourPop All-Star. I'm actually going to keep this. I've been wanting to try out the ColourPop like face products, and I haven't gotten a chance to try this, so I will be keeping it. Next, we have the Smashbox Photo Finish Minimizing Pores. This is loved, and I don't think I could get another ounce out of it, so it's going to be getting tossed. Okay, this is one of my favorite. <laughs> As you can see, I have like the two really big ones of the professional and then like a small one, but I think these are almost basically done. So they are going to go and then I'm going to keep the new little mini. Okay, just kidding. I must have not squeezed this all the way because <laughs> it is done for as well. So um, these are basically going to get decluttered or thrown away because they are done. This is the Huda Beauty Matte Perfection. I actually really like this. It has a very different tube on it. Um, it almost looks like a skincare tube on the end, but I really have enjoyed this one, so I will be keeping it. This is the Maybelline Baby Skin. I've actually had this for a while, so I think it's time to declutter, but it does actually remind me a lot of the Professional, except it's a lot more inexpensive than <laughs> the Professional. But again, it's been in my collection a while, so it's getting decluttered. Okay, this is the Makeup Forever Base Smoothing one. I actually have already decluttered one of these, but because I know this has been in my collection a while, it may actually be expired, so it is going to get decluttered. Okay, well, it's not focusing on this, but basically this is the Becca Backlight Priming Filter. I actually love this concealer, um, but it's been a while since I've used it, and it's looking like it may be kind of bad. So I'm going to declutter it, but this one is a really, really good one if you like a really, like, dewy finish. This is the Origins Original Skin. It's a very different primer. It's like a foam primer. Um, I've had this for a little bit, so I'm going to go ahead and declutter it or gift it to friends and family. Same kind of thing. So that one's going to go. Okay, this is the YSL All Hours Primer. I cannot remember if I like this one, but I know I haven't had it like super duper long, so I'm going to go ahead and keep it. Okay, this is the First Aid Beauty Pores Be Gone Matte Primer. I love First Aid Beauty products. I know I talk about them a lot that it's like my mom's favorite because she has such sensitive skin. This is a newer one that I have not tried yet, so I'm keeping it. Okay, this is from Koki Cosmetics. This is the Transfer Matte. I'm actually going to declutter this. I haven't tried it, but it's brand new, and I think it could go to a good home. This is the Pop 24K Face Base. Um, I haven't tried this, but just based on the formula, I'm not sure if I would like it. So I'm going to go ahead and declutter it. This is the Yenza Tone Up Primer Essential Glow. I actually met them at Destination Ipsy in Austin, which is where they gifted me this. So I'm actually going to keep this and try it out. Okay, these are two Hourglass Primers. We have the Mineral Veil Primer and then also the Primer Serum, but... I know I've had these for quite a while, so they are going to be getting decluttered. Okay, next is from Physicians Formula. This is their Spotlight Illuminating Primer. I've actually tried this and I wasn't, you know, super in love. So because I'm trying to be super picky about the stuff I'm decluttering, I'm going to say goodbye. This one is another Milk Makeup Primer in the stick form. So this one's actually the Luminous Blur Stick. So I'm actually going to be keeping this. It's just like the other blur, but it's luminous. <laughs> this is by Olay Henderson. This is the Banana Bright Face Primer. I actually got this at the Sephora sale this spring, so I'm actually going to be keeping it because I haven't used a lot, and it's a brightening primer. Okay, next we have the Pop Body Beam Base. Uh, this apparently somehow is in this video, and I don't think it's a primer, but I'm going to be decluttering it. <laughs> the next one's from Becca. This is their First Light Priming Filter. Honestly, I used to like a lot of the just, you know, really hydrating, dewy type primers but here lately I feel like now that I'm getting older I need more of like pore filling smoothing and all of that in one so I'm actually going to declutter this next we have the pop zero shine prime I actually tried this and I wasn't like super duper impressed by it so I'm going to be decluttering it okay this is the Fenty Beauty primer I cannot remember I think this primer is matte yeah um but I honestly don't even think I've used it and I don't think that I want like a super duper matte primer anymore. So I'm going to be decluttering it. This is from Guerlain. It has like little gold sparkles in it. And I really do like this primer. So I'm going to be keeping it. Okay, this is the Dr. Brandt Luminizing Primer. I actually am curious to try this since Dr. Brandt's a skincare brand. So 
we are going to be keeping this. This is the Professional, except it is the Pearl Primer. I mean, this was kind of okay, but I don't think I like it as much as the actual Pore Professional, so I'm going to be decluttering it. This is from Smashbox, and this is the Photo Finish Radiance Primer. I do really like this, but I think I have had it for quite a bit, and I feel like maybe somebody else can get some more use out of it, so it's going to be getting decluttered. Okay, this is from Cover FX. This is the Blurring Primer, and I think this is like their older packaging for it, so I'm actually going to be decluttering this as well. Okay, these are the Clarins SOS primers. So you have one that is for brightening, you have one for a sun-kissed look, and then another that deepens. I think I'm going to just keep the sun-kissed look one because I like primers that make me look a little bit tan too. Okay, this is the Jouer Anti-Blemish Matte Primer. I've had this one for a while, so it's actually going to be decluttered probably into the, the trash can. Okay, this is the Too Faced Do You Fresh Glow Primer. I like this one, but I didn't love it because it does give your skin more of a pink look. So I'm going to be decluttering it as well. This is the Guerlain Meteorites. It's got something on it, but I really do like this. It doesn't have too much left. So I'm going to keep it and try to go ahead and finish it. Okay, so this is from Chanel and Kat Von D. These are actually super old, so they have got to go. This is the Givenchy Prism Primer. It's pretty mattifying, but it also fills in your pores, and I like both of those things, so I'm going to be keeping it. This is another transfer mix. This is a foundation mixer for dewy foundation. I actually kind of want to try this. I didn't really want to try the matte one, but I think the dewy one, since it's a mixer in your foundation, would be pretty cool, so I'm going to be keeping it. Next, we have the Pure Bronze Your Selfie. I honestly like this but since I already kept the Clarins one that's a bronzer I'm gonna go ahead and declutter it. This is the Paracolm MD one. It's an instant mixer and I think it's similar to the Tatcha one so it's going to be getting decluttered. Next we have the Revlon Rose Glow. I like this. It was really hydrating but again it doesn't do anything for like your pores and such so it's going to be getting decluttered. This is the Becca Velvet Blurring Primer. This one's actually a really good one, but I think I have quite a few things that are going to be filling in my pores, so since I'm trying to tone down my collection, I'm going to go ahead and declutter it. Okay, this is the Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector. This is actually a liquid highlight, so I'm going to declutter it. It's not actually a primer. This is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Hyaluronic Hydrating Primer. I'm actually going to be keeping this. So this is the Coconut Skin Smoothie Primer from First Aid Beauty. My mom does actually like this, so I'm going to be decluttering it and giving it to her. This is the Tatcha Balanced Perfecting Water Gel. I've actually had this for a while, and it does have a six-month expiration, so it is going to be getting decluttered. This is very sad to say goodbye to. Okay, next we have the number seven Airbrush Away Tinted Skin Perfecting. Uh, primer. I'm actually going to declutter this. I don't have too many things from number seven, but it's going to go. Okay, these are the last two. Um, this is the It Cosmetics, and it has a 50 SPF. But I'm going to declutter it, and I'm going to keep the Primed and Peachy, because I do like the peach products by Too Faced. So now we're going to do an overview of what I'm keeping, getting rid of. So let's go. Okay, so this is what I'm keeping. Basically 24 primers. I feel like once we redo my beauty room in the next couple days, I'm probably going to be getting rid of some more, but these are the ones I'm keeping. This is the friends and family pile with my cell phone. <laughs> and then unfortunately this pile right here is what we were saying goodbye completely too. So I hope you guys enjoyed this declutter series and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!